jump on to Liberty. The Liberty Flames. And I cannot wait to talk about this. We we can't spend too long, but six and six last year. We we can because we can just smooth through the last two. That's true. That's true. All right. Returning starters for Liberty. Doesn't matter. Six offensive, <laughs> seven defensive. Look, experience nationally, number five in the country. God. They got a ton of returning starters back. Uh, not returning start, a ton of returning experience, guys that have played. Head coach Hugh Freeze replaces retiring Turner Gill. Uh, he inherits some talent on offense and a lot of experience. Defense, still going to be a problem. Defense has been a problem, but I, I love that Hugh Freeze got this job, right? It's it's perfect. It's great. Um, you want to talk about fit. Hey, you want to talk about all-time names. Do you know what their quarterback's name is? No. Dude. Give it to me. Buckshot Calvert. I'm dead serious. <laughs> now, I know he's got a real name, um, but I couldn't find it. Like, every preview magazine has this guy as a buckshot. So, Buckshot Calvert returns. He had 3,300 yards, 29 touchdowns, six interceptions. You going to look it up for I'm me? I'm trying. All right. Uh, three out of five offensive linemen return. The leading wide receiver and running back are back from the number 34 scoring offense in the country. Defense has major talent and depth problems. Uh, I mean, it, it just it ain't going to get better. Number 117 scoring defense, number 123 total defense. We got a name? Steven. Steven Calvert. I'm going to stick with Buckshot. Buckshot Calvert. I love this. Uh, so, yes, number 117 scoring defense last year, number 123 total defense. New defense coordinator, Scott Simons. He's bringing a 4-2-5 scheme, which you are really going to need if you got guys throwing all over you. Uh the secondary, they're going to have five guys back there at all times. The schedule sets up well enough to reach six wins. I think the biggest question is how long does Hugh Freeze stay here, right? Forever. You think forever? Yeah. Man, I think I think, he played, I think a couple of years at best. I think he played with the big boys. I think he tried to pick a fight with the biggest boy in all of college football. Won that fight on the field, lost the war. And then they tried to pick a fight with... The rule makers of college football lost that one badly and then got embarrassed and realized when people start digging through your personal stuff, all your skeletons come out. And I think now he's made enough money. This is his world in the way his religion is, in the way his personal beliefs are. And I think he can live in this area and coach at this school for the rest of his life and be happy. We'll see. I think he stays like two, maybe three years. I also have him going eight and four. I think good. Hugh Freeze, gracious. I think Hugh Freeze is an exceptional, exceptional coach. I've got him six and six. I, got a, I think he's an exceptional. Like coach. here's, a, I mean, just looking at the schedule, I like. I like, originally wrote down nine and three and thought that's ridiculous. Good that gracious. won't happen. I I caught, yeah. I caught myself. Well, I've I've got him starting out zero and three, right? Because I've, I've got a loss to Syracuse, loss at Louisiana, loss to Buffalo. I think they could win one of those three games. Okay, and then they beat Hampton, beat New Mexico. I don't think Syracuse is New one Mexico of those. State. But I think if, if you at told Louisiana me they, or Buffalo, if they, they could, beat one of at Louisiana or Buffalo, it wouldn't surprise me at all. No, no, that, I, could, I could see it. Hugh Freeze um, will be the best coach on the field. That's true. Oh, well, are we sure? Yes. Like, yes. Lance Leopold from yes. Buffalo? You, yeah. He, he took your boy Saban to the woodshed with garbage talent, okay? Yeah, he did not have garbage talent at Ole Miss. Are you crazy? He had four or five guys that made it to the NFL, and the rest of them, the rest of them couldn't be managers in the NFL. Okay, okay, okay. You you got a point. You got a point. And I don't know about taking to the woodshed. Let's not go crazy. Okay. Well, he beat. He's the only team to beat you back to back years. Yeah. That's and then true. you called the NCAA on him. That's it. fact. I that love happened. how you. I love how you jump in like it's me. That like happened. I'm the one that did it. You did it. I, I saw you do it. <laughs> We were doing the podcast. Man, I, I know. It's a, you want to know how many Ole Miss fans hate me? Good gracious. I'm sorry. Hey, if it had been Mississippi State, I would have done it to them too. I'm just saying. Uh, all right, so I'm not, – Not a denial. Got them three and three. Okay. And then I got them beating Maine, losing at Rutgers. But see, I can see them beating see, Rutgers. There's just, there's just no way this team loses to Rutgers. Hugh, Hugh Freeze is a, not going to lose to a Rutgers. A team. win at UMass, but a loss at BYU. A loss at Virginia, but a win at New Mexico State. I've got them six and six. I think I think they make it to a bowl game. 
I, this defense was so bad last year. No, there's no question. But there's going to be a lot of teams that make bowl games that have bad defenses. Because, right, but I think they can make it to a bowl game. college football has gone so offensively I just heavy. don't know about 8-4. Like what that do you is... think of Rutgers? So I think they're going to beat Rutgers, and I feel very good about that. I think they win one of those two Against Buffalo, Louisiana, Louisiana, Buffalo. Louisiana games. So now I've got my eight wins. Now you're eight and four. Or, or they lose both those games and they beat BYU. I don't know, man. BYU is that's, – that's a bunch of men. Like, I think it's a little different. They are substantially older than everybody yeah, else. That's all I'm saying. That's a bunch of men. That's different. That's, that's religion against religion. But that's right a there. holy war. Yeah, it is. I'm not getting into it's that. It's pretty crazy.